crisis in the city is taking its toll on businesses. Jeff Abel is live in Little Italy with an explanation tonight. Jeff. You know, Little Italy is not only right here in the heart of the city, but it is also one of the safest places in the city. But restaurant owners will tell you many people are still too scared to come here. It's one of the oldest, most visited neighborhoods in the city. But lately, there's a battle in Little Italy that's beyond its control. There is a perception that if you come into Baltimore, you, it's not good. Those who live and work in Little Italy say the city's crime crisis has become their crisis. At last night's town hall, the owner of one restaurant says he's considered whether to leave. Now more than ever, we've been here for 22 years since 1998, and we never once considered it before, but these days we're, we're thinking of it strongly. Again, I, I, I shudder to think about the day when the people who are invested most in this city have lost all hope and decided to roll up. Our customers never have to fear about being in Little Italy. But there's a perception of Baltimore in general that, that people can't shake. In fact, out of more than 82,000 911 calls in the city this year, just 38 came from Little Italy. Business owners say the perception of the city is not their reality. Still, it's taking its toll on convention and other business and limiting their ability to grow. If you don't take care of the garden around you, you're going to get weeds. Okay? So, we need to take care of this, and it's way overdue. Well, restaurant owners say it took them years to rebound following the riots four years ago. Now they fear the crime crisis will set them back once again. We're live in Little Italy tonight. Jeff Abel, Fox 45 News.